Did we ever come up with a um, chant for Alibat? We did, but I don't remember what we created. Aliabat, Aliabat, Ali, Abat, and her husband ran beer. That was not it. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our stupid Rexy. It's a Corbin. I'm Ali Abad. Uh, I don't. You let yourself go. Uh, <laughs> true. <laughs> true. That's the stress uh, of married life. And <laughs> uh, hey, now, congratulations yeah. to Ali Abad. Yeah. And her, and her, 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 Ali Abad's husband, Ranbir Kapoor. Yep. Um, on the new bundle of joy coming. I don't know when. Yep. But that's awesome. You know what that means, don't you? They're going to have a baby shower. That's true. Yeah. That's true. Probably going to get some good gifts. Yep. wonder what Priyanka's going to get her. A new house. or What, what are rich people I would, people for? I would, <laughs> if I had the money, I would actually give them a baby shower at the baby shower. A shower. An actual, like, shower for your baby. Anyways, uh, so a new Alibot film. What? Uh, teaser has come out. This is called Darlings, which is actually... Her first film under her production house. Nice. And it's also with Red Chilies. And so uh, they're great doing it together. But it not and only I see the Ali name Shafali Shah and, and Vijay Varma. And Rosh. We wow. Know, this guy we, we know, know less, but we yeah, know, we know less, him, but we know uh, of him. But... Roshan Matthew. But yeah, the, 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 the top three. And I think it's a dark comedy. Good. Um, so th just that intrigues me the hell out of me. Darlings sounds like a, a a film that would have been made by um, oh good grief. <sighs> Come on, Rick. Um, your mother. No. Oh, from the nineteen eighties. She oh, did. Oh, Cheryl Crow. <laughs> Pretty in Pink, Sixteen Candles, starts with an M. <sighs> Mark Brooks. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Margot Kidder, redhead. She was in the Kathy Bates. No. <laughs> Anyway, Breakfast Club. Come on! I know. I don't remember her name. I know you. You see about... her face, right? Yeah, it's gonna drive me crazy. Uh, Darling sounds like a movie she would do. Doggone it! Twenty-five of you have typed in the name already. Molly Ringwald. Thank you. I was about to look it up for you. I knew it started with an M. Anyways, but so this anyway. is the teaser. Uh, Whatever happened to Molly Ringwald? Don't know. I'm dead. Maybe. She might be. I don't know, Rick. People die. <laughs> I'm not saying I want her to be. I'm just saying it's a possibility because I don't know. Here we go. Equal Mindak Nadi ke pas aaram kar raha tha. Baad se pareshan ek pichhu rote hue aaya. Pichhu ne Mindak se pucha, "E Mindak, mere ko please Nadi paar karwa dena." Mindak bola, पर तूने मुझे काट लिया तो बिच्छू बोला अरे तू मैड है क्या अगर मैं तेर को काटा तो हम दोनों डूब जाएंगे तो मेंढक ने बिच्छू को अपने पीठ पे बिठाया अभी मेरे को कैसे मालूम पड़ेगा कि तुम बकवास कर रहे हो कि वो बकवास कर रहा है पर तैरते तैरते कुछ ऐसे ही नदी के बीच में पहुंचे हम सब आए बिच्छू ने मेंढक को काट लिया <laughs> I'm in. Hell yeah! I'm in. Yep. One. Uh, whoever cut it, by the way, did a phenomenal job. Beautiful music behind it. Yep. Be making With the narration. Get that kind of suspense feel to it. Yeah. Obviously, uh, you got some comedy in there as well. Um, whew, that looked good. Yep. And also, it, it actually reminded me of a Malayalam trailer in terms of it. A little not, bit. Yeah. Not giving you everything away. Yeah. It's kind of a very original, at least to my knowledge. I don't. 
I don't recall this story. It looks like something that Alia was like, it, it, this is her first venture. This is under she, her production house, obviously Red Chili's as well. Yeah. But this is her production house, her money. And she was like, I want, I want great actors as well. Exactly. I love that she was like, I yeah. want Vijay Varma, who's obviously she works with Gully Boy as well. And then Shafali Shah, which I'm sure she's admired. And maybe, I don't know if she... I don't know if they've worked, worked together with, or not. Know, but yeah. yeah, I mean, strong actors, obviously. And uh, I can't imagine this doesn't mean a lot to her because mm -hmm. um, it's her first one in her own production house. So good for her. And um, it's a great trailer. Yeah, yeah, that was it. Was a teaser, by yeah. the way. It was a teaser. Uh, it was long enough for me that it was just long enough could to have transcend been. teaser time. To Honestly, time. I know we'll get a trailer. Yeah, I don't even I think don't you even need, need one because obviously I'm gonna watch it. And one, it's on Netflix. It's not even going to theaters. Yeah, which is. I wonder if they're doing that on purpose because of what they people have noticed about what's doing well in theaters and what's doing well on OTT. Probably. Well, normally and, and, you'd never have like an Alia Bot film. But it's also interesting to me that it's Netflix. Yeah. Because that's an agreement with her production company and Red Chili's with Netflix. Yeah. And it's a very... Well, I'm sure there's a bunch of people bidded at Amazon. And it's... Absolutely. And that's good. Netflix needs it. Good for Netflix. Well, Netflix so, India is doing well. It's Netflix everywhere else. That's... Uh, outside yeah, of but comparatively, even still, Netflix is still pricier than everything else yeah. in, in India. So um it was really good. Well put together. Look who it was composed by. <laughs> of course of course the music's good. <laughs> if the trailer if the trailer I, slash teaser music was was, was, was him, Vishal. Um it's but a Vishal Bardwaj Vish, is it also uh, has a, a, another one as well so I don't know who was it was Pro Right. Say his name for me. Uh, Prashant Pillay. Forgive me if that's mispronounced. Um, it looks like there, but <laughs> of course she got. That's that's amazing. One, I love that everybody kind of came together and uh, for. I know it's not a director of directorial of hers, and I don't recognize this director. Abhishek Banerjee was part of the casting. So many ghosts in one room, which can promise you that everyone will be good if he's casting. Oh, I'm excited. Yep. I'm excited. August yep. August 5th on Netflix. I'm assuming it's going to have a runtime of about an hour and a half. Hour and a half, two, probably. Two tops, I yeah. bet. I don't think it would go much bigger than two. I mean, it could. It's comedy, drama, thriller. Yeah. That follows the lives of two women as they find courage and love in exceptional. That's a good. That's a I good like description. It. Everything about this. Yep. Screams. This could be one of the better films of the year. Yep. Um, and. It's yeah, it's so different. I love it. I love it. It was a really good teaser. I'm I'm really excited about it. What do you think has been your top five of the year, Indian wise? Well, R R R is yeah, number one. KGF obviously too. Yeah, it's a joke. Big joke. Um, <laughs> this year, uh, uh, Love Hostel. Yes. Um, uh, but I do. Yeah. Um, uh, what's the one? It's one word. It's the one with um Dilip and uh his son um. In the desert, um, Dilip? Not sorry, not Dilip. I'm thinking Dilip Kumar. Thar. You're thinking of Thar. Thar. Yes. Um, Thar would be in there. Um, I really, really liked Runveer's movie. Yeah, great. That, that's that's another one. You, you're missing a couple though. What else am I missing? Vikram. Oh yeah, yeah. Sorry. That's that's definitely you're, my top uh, top five of the year. Also missing the Malayalam one. The, the oh horror. yeah, the one. Yeah, I'm not saying it should be in your top five, but it no. Was... You know what? It's interesting. As much as I love that, and I think that that is a contender for like all the film festivals and stuff of that nature, um, I would watch those other ones again sooner. But and then you also have um, the Last Farmer. Yeah. Then you have Shafali's and. Uh, oh yeah, that was really that good. One. And then I really enjoyed Topeka's film. Oh. It's been a good. It's been a good. First half of 2022. I think the Pikas would make my top five. I really, really enjoyed I really that enjoyed film. that film. Um, it'd, probably but be, I, it'd probably be RRR is top. 100%. Right? So that's, that's, throw it, that out. That's, that's actually, in general, just one of my favorites of the year. Of the year, regardless period. Regardless of if it's Indian or not. Agreed. And you'll hear a lot of Americans say that if they've actually seen RRR. Um, but I love Hostel. Is, yeah, love Hostel is really good. Dapika's uh, RRR. I do. But I do. Easy. Uh, and then probably Vikram. And 
Ranveers, Love Hostel, the Malayalam one, Last Farmer. Those can all I can I can see why they would take the last spot for me. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I could for It'd be a battle for that. Yeah. Renviers, you could probably watch more. Yeah, but it wouldn't surprise me. Second half of the year, you're looking at this film. You're like, "Darlings was great." Yeah, I hope it I could hope so. suck. <laughs> but it <laughs> looks we're never good. just gonna be like, "Oh, that's gonna be a great film." No, how you many times? Say, it looks like it's gonna be great. How many times have you seen? Like, I there's a, a trailer for the new um, Viggo Mortensen film. The trailer looked spectacular. We went and saw it, and we're really disappointed. Mm. So you don't, you, we've, that's like you don't judge a book by its cover. You don't judge a film by its teaser or its trailer, because there can also be bad teasers and trailers. Well, case in point, I did not like the t the trailer for Elvis. Mm. I thought this does not look like it's going to be good. I've heard Tom Hanks isn't going to be doing great. Eh, I loved it. I do hear he gives like a career worst performance though. You know what? It's not. I liked him. The thing for me, career worst for Tom Hanks is Mr. Rogers. I did not enjoy him as Mr. Rogers. I think he was completely miscast as Mr. Rogers. I disagree with that. I know. A lot, but of, I a lot of people seen, liked it. I haven't seen Elvis, though. No. Uh, yeah, so I, I can't say on Elvis. It's not, it's not a career remembering performance, but yeah. it wasn't as I was expecting it to be awful. Yeah. And it wasn't. But it's all about Austin Butler. In fact, the Academy, uh, not the Academy, but Variety, at the halfway point, they're talking about who should be remembered during Oscar time. Austin Butler. RRR. Uh, <laughs> although, if you look at any halfway points, you'll see RRR on there if they've seen it. The, yeah. I've been looking. That was that was just individual yeah. like acting category. So, Anyways, yeah. this looks great. I can't wait for Me it. Me too. Uh, we will absolutely be watching it, obviously. Yep. come. Uh, also, you know what they say was coming with Shamshara. So there's rumors that Pothan could have a teaser. with, But that would be really early as that well. That would be early. For an Indian film. Yeah. It wouldn't be early for a Hollywood film. No. But it would be early for an Indian film. Yeah. Uh, but this is Shah Khan we're talking about. Anyways, anyway. let us know what you thought about the teaser and what should be our next Alibat uh, Vikram. Uh, Alibat Vikram? You meant Vijay Varma and Shafali Shah. Our dosed Vijay Varma and yeah. our future dosed Alibat and Shafali Shah. Let us know down below. <laughs> Josh!